The cost of filing immigration applications is going up. Tonight, an immigration attorney is warning of the effects likely to follow. Channel 5's Valerie Gonzalez explains. Bringing your spouse into the U.S., renewing your DACA permit, or filing to appeal a USCIS decision, the cost for all of these will go up by hundreds of dollars. U.S. Citizenship and Immigration Services are increasing their fees. If they don't, the agency stated in a press release they will be underfunded by $1.3 billion per year. They are posting their proposed changes on Thursday on the Federal Registry. Immigration attorney Jaime Diaz says the cost of immigrating a spouse will go up. That process contained three forms for just over $1,200. Now, those forms will have to be filed separately for a total cost of more than $2,000. Diaz believes the difference will affect many who work on minimum wage. And $1,000, that would mean that you're making minimum wage. I was, it will be probably seven weeks of every cent that you make would be devoted to, for you to be able to pay for the filing fees of that application. Those are just the filing fees and does not include the cost of hiring an attorney. The S says the longer immigrants wait to file, the more exposed they become to immigration targeted enforcement. DACA employment authorization applications will increase by $80. DACA renewals will now be charged $275. Filing an appeal to naturalization proceedings will now cost $1,755, a hike of more than $1,000. There are dozens of other changes. We'll have all of them up on our website after the newscast. These changes will take effect in the coming months. Normally, the SS, most people wait to file their applications when they get their income tax return. He advises to file earlier this year to avoid the increased fees. In the studio, Valerie Gonzalez, Channel 5 News at 6.